Previously on Final Fantasy VII Remake. I've never seen a Shinra breathe like that before. Music gallery. Will do. We'll sit down and shut up until we're finished. We start the episode at this frame and we end the episode at this frame. So let's start the ride and drink. Yes, I would like to wait until Tifa comes to the counter again. What is she drinking there? Ah, coffee. I heard you're having second thoughts. I know we have to think big if we're going to make a difference. But not like this. Oh. I just... I feel trapped. If it feels wrong, don't do it. <sighs> Best advice you can give a girl. Or a woman. There's something a man wants you to do and it feels wrong. Don't do it. Guess that's that then. What, they kick you out? We agreed to disagree. So, you want another drink? Tifa! Time to celebrate. Break out all the good stuff. Oh, sure. <laughs> we won't be needing you for this next job. Feel free to look for work elsewhere. Fine by me. That's how I like it. No contract. No obligation. Figured you'd say that. Here, the rest of your payment, along with a little extra for your exemplary service. And thus concludes our business. Gonna have to ask you to leave now. This here's a private affair. it over but in the end we didn't want to put so much on you this is our fight jesse what's the hold up uh, be right there no hard feelings huh it's fine let's talk more after i'm done here okay really it's fine come on jesse i'm dying here uh, i'll catch you later Sorry to keep you thirsty boys waiting. Avalanche! <laughs> that hit the spot. Damn, Biggs. Slow down. <laughs> we'll talk later. I promise. Sorry, you were saying? Keep it tight. Ain't no room for error come tomorrow. More reason. When the job's done, we're done. Your words. Okay, what were we talking about? Yep, best way to clear your head so you can focus when it... We were all pushing real hard for you, you know? So, where'd we leave off? It's been too long since we did this. Not since we oh. went on that all-night um, bender after H. It could get pretty dicey out there. Oh, my bad. Continue. They did not give us the boot. It wasn't... Bet you could use a bite to eat too, huh? Oh... Uh... Where were we? Uh, just thinking about it's making me mad again. I can't believe it's already been So, here. that's it? I don't know how we managed. Uh, how do we come it's together? What's up with them? Where it is, he lives in this town. Just shut up and wait. We'll find him soon enough. Hey, brother. You from around the way? I guess. No big man with a big gun strapped to his right arm? Heard he set up shop somewhere in the neighborhood. That depends. Ah. <laughs> Clever. Smell an opportunity to make some scratch, do you? Five hundred. Two hundred. Mm. Three. Whatever, man. 
Let's find somewhere quiet to talk. Walk with me. Hey! Got something to say? What? You looking at me? Yeah, are these chocobos? Move it! Are you so sorry? Move. Red chocobos. I mean, I know Look at all these, these assholes staring at us. This shit holds got nothing on Walmart. Signs like right? letters, but I mean, it looks like red chocobos. Don't know. Word of advice, Blondie. Yeah, Don't boss. piss off my friend here. You'll be real sorry. Unless you got some kind of death wish, that be my guest. <laughs> yeah. I don't like him. After you, uh, brother. And don't worry. I ain't the backstabbing type. Most days. So what's your problem? The Chinra gave the money to kill me. Do they want to talk to me? Or just to use the opportunity? Spill it! You know where the bastard's hiding, don't you? I told you before. That depends. Oh yeah? You wasted my time! Shinra's time, you mean? <laughs> Shinra knows better than to stick its nose in my boss's business. Like I give a shit. Okay. No holding back. <laughs> Hey, over here! Look at some crap. Here it comes. Belts. If they weren't Shinra, then not my problem. Lesson one for life on the ground floor. Get some rest. Okay. Yeah, yeah, so heading back to get a little sleep. Oh yes, we are heading back. Tomorrow. Do do and we sleep over in the apartment. Oh, Jesse there. <laughs> Welcome home, honey. Took your sweet time. Uh, uh <clears throat> Psych. Psych. <sighs> Are you gonna let me in so we can talk in private? Okay, she's definitely not there to get some love. Or like love interest and stuff like that. Guess I'll get right to the point then. Huh, what have you got there? An apology for not getting you on the mission. Uh. Or not, what do you think it is? A proposition. Nailed it in one. Gonna have to ask you to keep all this a secret from the others, though. It's a personal matter. Something I need to sort out tonight. Tonight? Tonight. You and me, together. I want you to come with me to the Sector 7 plate. I'll give you the details on the way. That's fine by me, but don't you have a pretty big day ahead of you? 
I do, but if I don't deal with this now, it's only gonna get harder. Anyway, I can count on you, can't I? Hmm. Oh. A down payment. Whoa. We got Efret. Doubt we'll be back before morning, in case you were planning on traveling light. Make sure you've got everything you need before we leave. I'll wait here. Materia. Oh no. Yeah. No, no, no. Everett. Oh, the fire demon looks so good. Oh, by the way. Need to sleep? Yes. No. And I need to have another drink. It's called a lemonade. Oh. Now the door's closed, huh? And there she is waiting. You all set? Yeah. Take all the time you need. Nothing a woman likes more than being kept waiting. <laughs> but seriously, get your ass in gear already. Okay. Well. Hmm. I think that all. You that's all our set? All. Yeah. Awesome. Meet me at the station after dark. Don't be late. Just another job. Oh yeah, tell yourself. It's just another job, tell yourself. Ooh, mercenary endeavor. Stargazer Heights, a small apartment building located in Sector 7. Ah, la, 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 la. Okay, okay, okay. I don't need this to know. Oh! Material growth. Mm-hmm. So, I don't need to use material to get huh? it better. I just need to equip it. Tough break. They changed the times. Last train's already left. Which is why we borrowed these bikes. Need a lift to the plate? How did you guess? Easy. You've been acting weird. Like talking about one thing when you're obviously thinking about something else. Yeah, and don't get me started on all that pep. All right, I'll give you that. But how did you know I wanted to head topside? Was I talking in my sleep? What else did I say? No, we just figured you wanted to see your parents, that's all. Nailed it, huh? Yep, right on the head. So, seeing as we don't have any family of our own, how about you let us be a part of yours for a bit? You know, spread the wealth. Hmm. Are your parents still around? Huh? Uh, no. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay then. Well, guess you're all invited. Here's to awkward family of... reunions. Yeah! But we will talk about that. <laughs> but it is this part of the game series. Oh. I take it you boys have your brand spanking new IDs? Yes, ma'am. Then let's lay down some rubber. <laughs> Try that frog. Okay, you got it. Okay. Driving by holding me? his sword. I mean, yeah. Just so you know, I'm not going plate side for the reason they think I am. Look, you saw the way the reactor went up. It was huge, right? Because of all the Mako. Isn't that what you said? Yeah. That was wishful thinking. Deep down, I know it was my fault. I used a more powerful blasting agent than the directions called for. It had nothing to do with the Mako. Let's say you're right. So what? I'm planning on using a weaker blasting agent this time. But, since I can't get in touch with my supplier, our only option is to loot a warehouse owned by Shinra. Shinra? Good luck with that. With your help, we won't need luck. 
much better. You can promise, and an abiding affection for your family. But one cannot simply die in one fight. Ha! Enjoying yourself? Nay, one must unlock its true potential. Become one with the machine. Like this. Wow. I only have eyes for you. Your fiery gift for you. Come on. So close. Enjoying yourself. Give us a smile. Come on. You look more dancing if you did. How the fire rages! Enjoying yourself? Yeah! That was so cool! Okay. Definitely the point. Had enough? Don't be absurd. As if I could ever grow tired of your company. Naughty naughty! Until one of our flames is forever extinguished, the flames will never rest! <laughs> Fight for me! <laughs> Come on, let's push it past the red line! Jesse, take over. Huh? <laughs> Well, well, well. I do believe this round is yours. <laughs> Maybe next time we can keep it just between the two of us. Maybe. <laughs> Until we meet again, my friend! Okay. My well, friend. We Not did it! My... Go team! Not... Don't get too excited. Reinforcements are hot on our trail. But at least. Oh, let's say. That was interesting. And I really like the desk. You passed the test. What test? Driving. Did more than just pass. Not really. You made it by the skin of your teeth, if we're being honest. Whatever. Ah, I bet you held back because I was with you. Didn't want you to fall. So now I'm too weak to stay on a bike? Huh? Huh? <sighs> just hold on tight, will you? <sighs> what? I might be falling after all. Psych? <laughs> huh? Oh, would you look at that? It's the end of the ride. Oh, it's the end of the ride. We'll go on foot from here. Don't want to draw too much attention to ourselves. Hey, did these things leave a mark? <laughs> they got you pretty good. Oh, and I'm running on fumes. <laughs> Don't worry. We'll top you up soon enough. Now let's roll. Huh. They're still acting more like kids. And I mean, the only one who's really have the mind of a kid. Yes. Which? Okay. 
so. The residential area is just beyond this gate. Mind doing the honors? We're in the regi <sighs> residential areas with guns. Okay, is this for real? I have a mega big sword. You've got an arm All on of you have weapons, and especially Wedge have a grenade thrower. I don't know. Are people here around equipped like they are paramilitary? Here we are. The employee housing district, where they put you when your parents work for Shinra. While their reactors were slowly killing the planet, we were living the good life. Well, our industry is killing many people in the third world, and we are living a good life. So, that's what I really like about Final Fantasy VII since ever. It's an environmental saving pro story. I mean, you have to be good to the planet to save the whole world, and that's what you should do in real life, too. Figures. Still leaves the lights on every night for the girl who only comes home once every other blue moon. Mom's an old-fashioned type like that. Think she'll make us pizza? Her Midgar special? She's quite the cook. Quick to whip up finger-licking food, even if you drop by in the dead of night. And she loves guests who ask for seconds or thirds. Okay, let's head in. Cloud, you know what to do. Why don't you wait around the corner over there? Ah, uh, okay. It's a shame you won't get to try the Midgar special. You would have really liked it. Now go here and stay there. Oh, and then you see the full moon. With your help, we won't need luck. You'll take on just about any job, right? Well, I need you to rob my house. Think you can do that for me? Go in through the back door when the coast is clear. <laughs> the signal will be obvious. Uh, and there's that one cat. Once the lights come on, it's go time. Oh, the cats are a metaphor for you. Oh. <laughs> But you know what? We take that moment when we saw the metaphor of the cats and save. Because we are reaching the end of the stream. I'm so sorry I surprised you with that a little bit, but well, it was rather a short stream. Better than no stream, wasn't it? And yes. If you want to see the old things and maybe they aren't available at Twitch anymore, please go to my YouTube channel. Maybe you like to subscribe, like and share. Or just comment how bad my English is and tell me what I should change. And yes, they will change some things in the process of making this, but I don't want to tell you too much. Now, nowadays, I can do what I really wanted to do. You know, back then in Final Fantasy VII, I just wanted to make a save point just before I have to do a decision because then I could undo that decision if I wanted to. Later on, I lost the first... the first of the three discs big triangle broke out of it and that just ended my career of playing Final Fantasy from the beginning forever so I was never able to play it again until then and now I'm so happy to do but without further ado 
I would say we just look back around here to the lights of the streets and remember all what kind of action and what kind of emotions we felt until now. So there's nothing left to say for me than have fun playing Final Fantasy VII Remake by your own or rewatch everything I played for now. And we will see us next time on my stream and maybe on YouTube too. So there's nothing left to say for real now. Then goodbye internet yours truly Hade. if you like this video please feel free to like comment share subscribe and activate the notification